Now to Frankfurt and the ongoing argument over using public money for private schools. The state Supreme Court ruled against school choice supporters last year, but now they're pushing for a constitutional change, which opponents say is a bad idea. LAX 18's political reporter Carolina Buchek shows us today's new developments. Supporters of school choice in Kentucky say what they're asking for is simple. I just think it's important to have options when it comes to our kids. They want all Kentucky parents to be able to choose schools other than their local public school, despite their financial situation. Mama knows best. And in 2021, they thought they finally got that ability. When lawmakers passed the Education Opportunity Account Act, which awarded tax credits for people who made donations in support of private school tuition. We're still here! But opponents took issue with that because they felt the law diverted public money away from public schools. I believe in our public schools and that our public dollars should only go to our public schools. And the Kentucky Supreme Court struck down the school choice law. In the ruling, the court made it clear that the law violated the state's constitution by raising money for education other than in common schools. So that was a big loss for school choice supporters, but it also gave them an idea, a constitutional amendment. We knew that we were going to have to take this issue directly to the voters. Lawmakers who support school choice are pushing this bill forward, which would put the question of school choice on the ballot for voters to decide. They would allow us as the legislature to be able to put monies through the budget, state budget outside of common schools in regard to education. Parents like Leah Repko say that would help Kentucky families who need options other than public schools. My son's neurodivergent and I I just knew he was going to need to learn in a non-traditional class setting. I'm fortunate enough to have made that choice for him. Um, other people aren't so fortunate. But public school supporters like Governor Andy Bashir say public money should be used only on public schools. Most school systems across the, the Commonwealth, they are the only option in their community. If there are criticisms of our public schools, let's fund them, let's fix it, and let's not divert money away from them. Lawmakers say the constitutional change would not impact public school funding. But public, public money for public schools! But public school supporters are skeptical. Some have already made it clear they will fight back on this effort. In Frankfurt, Carolina Butrek, LX18 News.